I will praise the name of God with a song. I will magnify him with thanksgiving. Psalm 69, 30. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him, bless his name. For the Lord is good, his steadfast love endures forever and his faithfulness to all generations. Psalm 100, four and five. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, teaching and admonishing one another in all wisdom, singing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs with thankfulness in your hearts to God. And whatever you do in word or deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. Colossians 3, 16 and 17. Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything, by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians 4, 6. Some were fools through their sinful ways, and because of their iniquities suffered affliction. They loathed any kind of food, and they drew near to the gates of death. Then they cried to the Lord in their trouble, and he delivered them from their distress. He sent out his word and healed them, and delivered them from their destruction. Let them thank the Lord for his steadfast love, for his wondrous works to the children of man, and let them offer sacrifices of thanksgiving, and tell of his deeds in songs of joy. Psalm 107, 17 through 22. But I, with the voice of thanksgiving, will sacrifice to you, what I have vowed I will pay, salvation belongs to the Lord. Jonah 2, 9. Praise the Lord. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. For his steadfast love endures forever. Psalm 106, 1. Rejoice always. Pray without ceasing. Give thanks in all circumstances. For this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for you. 1 Thessalonians 5, 16 through 18. Out of them shall come songs of thanksgiving and the voices of those who celebrate. I will multiply them and they shall not be few. I will make them honored and they shall not be small. Jeremiah 30, 19. Therefore, let us be grateful for receiving a kingdom that cannot be shaken. And thus, let us offer to God acceptable worship with reverence and awe. Hebrews 12, 28. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the peoples. Sing to him, sing praises to him, tell of all his wondrous works. 1 Chronicles 16, 8 and 9. I thank him who has given me strength, Christ Jesus our Lord, because he judged me faithfully, appointing me to his service. 1 Timothy 1, 12. Therefore, as you received Christ Jesus the Lord, so walk in him, rooted and built up in him and established in the faith, just as you were taught, abounding in thanksgiving. Colossians 2, 6 and 7. O oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the man who takes refuge in him. Psalm 34, 8. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your iniquity, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit, who crowns you with steadfast love and mercy, who satisfies you with good so that your youth is renewed like the eagles. Psalm 103, one through five. But thanks be to God who gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. First Corinthians 15, 57. First, I thank my God through Jesus Christ for all of you because your faith is proclaimed in all the world. Romans 1, 8. You will be enriched in every way, to be generous in every way. 
which through us will produce thanksgiving to God. For the ministry of this service is not only supplying the needs of the saints, but is also overflowing in many thanksgivings to God. 2 Corinthians 9, 11 and 12. For everything created by God is good, and nothing is to be rejected if it is received with thanksgiving, for it is made holy by the word of God and prayer. 1 Timothy 4, 4 through 5. Giving thanks always and for everything to God the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Ephesians 5.20 For although they knew God, they did not honor Him as God or give thanks to Him, but they became futile in their thinking and their foolish hearts were darkened. Claiming to be wise, they became fools. Romans 1, 21 and 22. Continue steadfastly in prayer, being watchful in it with thanksgiving. Colossians 4, 2. I will give thanks to the Lord with my whole heart. I will recount all of your wonderful deeds. Psalm 9, 1. For it is all for your sake, so that as grace extends to more and more people, it may increase thanksgiving to the glory of God. 2 Corinthians 4, 15. For here we have no lasting city, but we seek the city that is to come. Through him, then let us continually offer up a sacrifice of praise to God, that is the fruit of lips that acknowledge his name. Hebrews 13, 14 and 15. The Lord is my strength and my shield. In him my heart trusts and I'm helped. My heart exults and with my song I give thanks to him. Psalm 28. 7. Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has blessed us in Christ with every spiritual blessing in the heavenly places. Ephesians 1, 3. You shall keep the feast of harvest, of the first fruits of your labor, of what you sow in the field. You shall keep the feast of ingathering at the end of the year, when you gather in from the field the fruit of your labor. Exodus 23, 16. Let them thank the Lord for his steadfast love, for his wondrous works to the children of man, for he satisfies the longing soul and the hungry soul he fills with good things. Psalm 107, 8 and 9. And he took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and gave it to them, saying, This is my body, which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Luke 22, 19. And now we thank you, our God, and praise your glorious name. 1 Chronicles 29, 13. Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights, with whom there is no variation or shadow due to change. James 1, 17. I will give to the Lord the thanks due to his righteousness, and I will sing praise to the name of the Lord, the Most High. Psalm 7, 17. Thanks be to God for his inexpressible gift. 2 Corinthians 9, 15. And you will say in that day, give thanks to the Lord, call upon his name, Make known his deeds among the peoples. Proclaim that his name is exalted. Sing praises to the Lord, for he has done gloriously. Let this be made known in all the earth. Isaiah 12, 4 and 5. Let there be no filthiness, nor foolish talk, nor crude joking, which are out of place. But instead, let there be thanksgiving. Ephesians 5, 4. There is none like you among the gods, O Lord, nor are there any works like yours. All the nations you have made shall come and worship before you, O Lord, and shall glorify your name. For you are great and do wondrous things. You alone are God. Teach me your way, O Lord, that I may walk in your truth. Unite my heart to fear your name. I give thanks to you, O Lord my God, with my whole heart and I will glorify your name forever. 
Psalm 86, 8 through 12. The Lord your God is in your midst, a mighty one who will save. He will rejoice over you with gladness. He will quiet you by his love. He will exult over you with loud singing. Zephaniah 3, 17. Give, and it will be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, running over, will be put into your lap. For with the measure you use, it will be measured back to you. Luke 6, 38. Saying, we give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty, who is and who was, for you have taken your great power and begun to reign. Revelation 11, 17. That their hearts may be encouraged, being knit together in love, to reach all the riches of full assurance, of understanding and the knowledge of God's mystery, which is Christ, in whom are hidden all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge. Colossians 2, 2 and 3. And it was the duty of the trumpeters and singers to make themselves heard in unison in praise and thanksgiving to the Lord. And when the song was raised with trumpets and cymbals and other musical instruments in praise to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever, the house, the house of the Lord was filled with a cloud. 2 Corinthians 5, 13. And they were to stand every morning, thanking and praising the Lord, and likewise at evening. 1 Chronicles 23, 30. For long ago, in the days of David and Asaph, there were directors of the singers, and there were songs of praise and thanksgiving to God. Nehemiah 12, 46. But thanks to God, who in Christ always leads us in triumphal procession, and through us spreads the fragrance of the knowledge of him everywhere. 2 Corinthians 2, 14. And they sang responsively, praising and giving thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever toward Israel. And all the people shouted with a great shout when they praised the Lord, because the foundation of the house of the Lord was laid. Ezra 3, 11. To you, O God of my fathers, I give thanks and praise, for you have given me wisdom and might, and have now made known to me what we asked of you, for you have made known to us the king's matter. Daniel 2, 23. Worthy are you, our Lord and God, to receive glory and honor and power. For you created all things, and by your will they existed and were created. Revelation 4, 11. In this you rejoice, though now for a little while, if necessary, you have been grieved by various trials, so that the tested genuineness of your faith, more precious than gold, that perishes, though it is tested by fire, may be found to result in praise and glory and honor at the revelation of Jesus Christ. 1 Peter 1, 6 and 7. That my glory may sing your praise and not be silent. O Lord my God, I will give thanks to you forever. Psalm 30, 12. Only fear the Lord and serve him faithfully with all your heart. For consider what great things he has done for you. 1 Samuel 12, 24. For what thanksgiving can we return to God for you, for all the joy that we feel for your sake before our God? 1 Thessalonians 3, 9. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Numbers 6, 24 through 26.